alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome, my dears, first from secondary. This is Mrs. Shreema Saeed. Today we will talk about determinant. Welcome, my dears, again. Determinants. If A is a square matrix of order 2 by 2, like A equals A, P, C, D, then the determinant of the matrix A is denotes A and is called determinant of the second order. How can we calculate the determinant of A? We note that the value of the determinant of the second order equals the product of the two elements of the principal diagonals minus the product of the two elements of the other diagonal, which is A times D minus PC. This is principal diagonals minus other diagonals. For example, if A is a square matrix of order 2 by 2, where A equals 2, 1, 5, and 7. Then the determinant of the matrix A is the number as follows. The determinant of A equals 2. Equals 2 by 7 minus 5 by 1. 2 by 7 equals 14. 5 by 1 equals 5. 14 minus 5 equals 9. So the value of this determinant equals 9. Now find the value of each of the following determinants. The first one, how can we calculate the value of the first determinant? Firstly, we will multiply 2 by negative 1, then subtract the product of 5 and 1. 2 times negative 1 minus 5 times 1. 2 times negative 1 equals negative 2. 5 times 1 equals 5. So the value of this determinant equals negative 7. What about the second one? We will multiply 0 by negative 1, then subtract the product of 4 and 5. 0 times negative 1 equals 0, minus 4 times 5, which is 20. 0 minus 20 equals negative 20. What about the third one? This determinant A, B, P, and C, you know that the value of the determinant of the second order equals the product of the two elements of the principal diagonals minus the product of the two elements of the other diagonals. So we must calculate the product of the principal diagonals at first. A times C equals AC minus the product of the other diagonals, which is p times b equals p squared. So the value of this determinant equals ac minus p squared. Now determine whether the matrix has an inverse. If it has an inverse, find it. M equals negative 1, 3, 4, and 6. How can we calculate the determinant of this matrix? Firstly, we will multiply negative 1 by 6, then subtract the product of 3 and 4, because negative 1 and 6 is the principal diagonal. Negative 1 times 6 equals negative 6, minus 3 times 4, which is 12. So the value equals negative 18. The third order determinant. The determinant of the matrix of order 3 by 3 is called the third order determinant. To find the value of the third order determinant, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, and I, we say that equals A times the determinant of E, F, H, and I, minus B times D, F, G, and I, 
plus C times D, E, G, and H. Cancel the first column and the first row and multiply the first element with the determinant of the rest. A times this determinant minus, after that, pay attention for this sign, plus, minus, plus. So, minus B cancelled its row and its column and take the rest elements. D, F, G, and I. After that, plus C cancelled its colon and its row and takes the rest determinant D, E, G, and H. You can easily calculate the value by multiplying A by E, I minus H, F. Minus B times D I minus F G plus C times D H minus E G. Now find the value of the determinant 1, 2, 3, 4, 0, 5, 7, negative 2, negative 1. Firstly, we will choose the first element 1, then cancel its column and its row, multiplied by the determinant of 0, 5, negative 2, and negative 1. Minus 2, cancel its column and its row, and multiply it by the determinant of 4, 7, 5, and negative 1. Plus, plus 3, Cancel its column and its row and multiply it by the determinant of the rest elements 4, 0, 7, and negative 2, like this. Now we will calculate the value 0 times negative 1 minus 5 times negative 2. Minus 2 times 4 times negative 1 minus 5 times 7. Plus 3 times 4 times negative 2 minus 0 times 7. 0 minus negative 10, which is 10 times 1 equals 10, minus 2 times negative 4 minus 35, which is negative 39, plus 3 times negative 8. 10 times 1 equals 10, negative 2 times negative 39 equals positive 78, Positive 3 times negative 8 equals negative 24. So the value is 64. This is our lesson today and that is the end of the lesson. See you in next lesson, inshallah, with all my best wishes. Shayma Saeed.